It's National Crime Victims Rights Week, and many people were at Sugar House Park to participate in the resource fair, fair and walk to raise awareness. Now, people may not realize what resources are out there or how to find them. The goal of the event was to provide people with those resources to help them escape situations and help them recover and to help the victims feel safe in reporting the crime. So a lot of times, um, I think of the isolation, no knowing, um, feeling like you're the only one going through this item or going through the victimization, whatever it is, um, it could be really harmful for someone. There will be events going on all week, including an art walk at the Utah Museum of Contemporary Art on Tuesday and film panel discussions toward the end of the week. Along with the rest of the events, there is a candlelight vigil tonight at the Utah State Capitol. All of the, this week's events, including tonight, are free and open to the public. Most of those events will also be streamed online for those who cannot make it out. The vigil takes place on the south steps and starts at 540 and is expected to last about two hours.